よほうんはい yes, a ver c a r d ¿qué te pasa? hola, ¿qué tal? por cierto ¿vamos a continuar? I thought I said I don't want to talk about it anymore not particularly I, I guess it wouldn't hurt exactly either though I, I, I don't know why you're so interested when I think of all the men who betrayed us the one that stands out above all of them is the one that I respected the most Saul you don't I thought everyone did but Admiral Saul Carath is the commander of the entire Sith fleet he's half the reason Malak has done so well in the war Saul was my commanding officer back when the Mandalorian Wars first began he taught me everything about being a soldier And I looked up to him. Saul approached me before he left. He talked to me about how the Republic was on the losing side and about how I should start thinking of my survival. I know now that he was trying to recruit me into the Sith, but I couldn't have conceived of it back then. I, I argued with him and he got angry and he left. I never saw him again. Saul was my mentor. He led us to so many victories against the Mandalorians. Even when things looked to be at their worst, I just I couldn't conceive of it. He, he couldn't be serious. I was wrong, of course. He not only left us for the Sith, he, he gave them the codes to bypass our scanners. I remember waking up as the first of the Sith bombers snuck past our defenses and began destroying half of our dock ships. I knew right away what had happened. I mean, I could have stopped him. I, I could have stopped it all. I blame Saul, not myself. I was, I was stupid and I ignored the danger. He nearly destroyed us all. No, I fought Saul for years now, and if I ever catch up to him, he will regret what he's done. He will regret it. No, no, it's not. But I don't want to talk about it right now. Vale, Carl. No te enfades. Uh, ¿Qué estaba haciendo yo? Sí. Sí, sí, sí. En el anterior vídeo fui un poco rápido a por los cristales para conseguir el sable verde, que es el que me gusta. Y ahora volveré a ver la finca de los Andral. Mi droid está todavía perdido. Puedo sentirlo como un hueco en mi corazón en mi aching heart. ¿Cómo lo hago? Para conseguir puntos de la luz. My droid destroyed. No, no, this cannot be happening. I can't bear to live without him. A todo esto. Carísimo. <ríe> y... Tu muchacho que llevas. Ah, vale. Vale. Bueno, vamos a ver. Vamos a ir por aquí. Matal es la otra familia en Discordia. Están los Sandral y los Matale y los Mandalorianos. Que están aquí. Ah. A ver qué tal. No, por favor, 
take my wife and children instead. Anything. Oh. <laughs> ah, wife and children. Sounds like a good idea. Carabina. I'm here. Yes. Vale. Uh... Ah, aquí está la arboleda. Vale. Mira, qué rápido hemos llegado. Voy a ocuparme de los bichos que me he dejado por aquí. El peligroso es ese blanco de ahí. Ese es el peligroso. Me van a matar. Thank <laughs> you. 
Qué buenos los dos. Muy buenos los dos. Y muy malo yo. ¿Cómo me voy a enfrentar a esto yo ahora? Vamos. Muy bien. Muy bien. Muy bien. Pues vamos a ver a Sandra. Pero me parece... Voy a cambiar de grupo. Bienvenida, Misia. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? The council. If you are here because of Shen Matalin's disappearance, you are wasting your time. The sandals are not involved. This is nothing but a Matale witch hunt. We were at left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Murat will meet with you there.
I have been informed by my protocol droid that you wish to speak to me. Cassus is dead. I was afraid of this. Yet in my heart I knew it must be true. What what happened to my son? Cath hounds? I, I was so certain the Matali family was to blame. But this changes nothing. My own son is dead. Why should I shed one tear about the disappearance of my bitter enemy's son? Typical. Anything to continue the feud which has become so customary to you people. I must ask you something, though it is difficult for me. My son had a diary, his private personal thoughts. Please, the diary means more to me than it ever could. I thank you for this. The diary is all I have left of my son. We have nothing further to discuss. Please, leave me to my grief. You are here from the Council, are you not? Looking for Shen Metale? My name is Rahasia. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief and... My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He... You must understand that father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. My father has kidnapped Shen Matale. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Metales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. I see. Well, there is the answer we seek. The Jedi Council should be informed of this at once. No. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He might hurt him if you do that. He no longer even cares if the Metales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. I am afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. Shen is an innocent victim in all this. My father is not a bad man, but his grief has driven him to madness. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. Alan Matale and my father have had problems ever since they settled on this world. To hear my father tell it, Alan is a brute and a bully, but a rich one. He feels his credits give him the right to step all over normal people. My father stands up to Alan because no one else will. But now he thinks Alan has taken my... Please find Shen. Pues sí. Vamos a buscarla. Es más de lo que parece. ¿Qué tal? ¡Uy! Aquí. ¡Hola! ¿Qué? ¿Qué puedo hacer?
Llave de la prisión. Please find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Shen and I, we, well, we have been taught by our families to hate each other, just for being related to our fathers. But I met Shen alone one day in the city, away from his father, and and Shen was so charming, so we talked and <laughs> met again over months and fell in love. My, please find Shen and free him. Ah, el amor. Yes? Sure. Who are you? What do you want with me? Rescue me. No. I won't leave. It's too... Venga. It's not my own safety I'm concerned about. I'm worried about the fate of Nurik's daughter, Rahasia. She's been trying to convince her father to release me ever since I was captured. If I escape, Nurik will think Rahasia is to blame. Nurik is insane with grief over the loss of his son, Cassus. If you can convince Rahasia to escape with us, I will accompany you. Though I do not know if she'd be willing to turn her back on her home and family. Who could imagine a Sandra doing such a thing for the sake of a Matali? I would rather face my own death than have her face her father's wrath because I escaped. I was taught to hate the Sandrals, to think of them as evil and subhuman. She was like an angel. I don't know what else I could have done but fall in love with her. For months I wooed her and tried to win her heart. Our families are always coming between us one way or another. Vámonos. Estáis al lado, ¿eh? Ya voy yo. Shen can be so stubborn sometimes, but I know Shen would rather die than leave me here alone to face the wrath of my father. Hey. Vale. You're back. Have you spoken to Rahasia? I pray she is not just telling me what I want to hear. Shen, you're safe. Rahasia. Well, thank goodness you managed to escape. It was all thanks to this kind Jedi that we managed to get this far at all. I thank you, Jedi, for all that you have done for us. No, we know that you must have gone to great personal risk to get us out of the Sandral state undetected. But surely we can... Y aquí están. There you are, Shen. Father, Mr. Matale. Rahasia. Father, Mr. Sandro. Nurik. Alan. I knew this was all your doing. I knew you had captured my son. You had taken my Cassus from me long before that. You started it. I don't want to hear any of your excuses. I will get revenge for your transgressions. Please listen to him, Father. Why should I listen to the Jedi? All you want is to remain with that Sandral harlot. My daughter is not a harlot, Matale dog! Mm. 
We are trying to be reasonable here, of course. We are sensible people, after all. But our children are being so stubborn. If Shen would just understand that he has to do what I want, this would all be solved easily. But he is my son. I don't want to lose him. And I won't let my daughter go with him. My little Rahasia. Father. I... I don't know why we fight like this. We got along in the beginning, didn't we, Alan? I don't know how you can think of that when we have our children trying to go away together. Well, it wouldn't be so bad, would it? Shen seems to genuinely care for my Rahasia. He might be a good husband for her someday. Hmm. As much as I may dislike it, I think I see it too. I suppose, I suppose I might be convinced to see that sandal girl with my son, if she is loyal to him. But I don't trust you a centimeter farther, old man. Your daughter may treat Shen well, but you will never see them. They will live with me. Of course not, you pompous old windbag. They'll be living with me. Of course not! My house <laughs> is more than good enough! I will not have them set foot in a Sandral household! They shall not live with the Matales! Then you propose to buy us a new house, do you? Oh, uh, well... Yes, actually, that sounds like a good idea. I'm surprised. That does sound like a good idea. We should discuss this more. Thank you, Master Jedi, for bringing us together and getting our parents to accept us. We will praise you to the Council for what you have done and name our children after you. Thank you again. We will remember you always. Me ha vuelto loco. Bien. Muy bien. Haya paz. Haya paz. No, esta sí es no. Ah. Sure. Bueno. Pues está bien. Voy a volver un momento. No, lo haré directamente. Mission, is that you? It's me, Lena. Remember? I was dating your brother back on Terrace. Lena, what are you doing here? Where's Griff? I'm just passing through. Griff and I broke up a few months after we left Terrace together. Probably for the best. Your brother can be charming, Mission, but he's bad news. Don't you start trashing my brother, you cantina rat! <laughs> Mission, what's wrong with you? Why are you acting this way? You've got your facts a little backwards. Mission could have come with us if she wanted to. It was her choice to stay behind. You liar! Griff told me that you didn't want his little sister tagging along. That's why he had to leave me behind. Is that what the hut spawn told you? I wanted you to come with us, Mission. I even offered oh, to pay for your ticket. Why not? I paid for everything else while I was with that freeloader. But he told me you didn't want to leave Terrace. I said we shouldn't even go then. But he said we'd come back and get you after we struck it rich on Tatooine. Just another one of his lies. No, you're the one who's lying. Griff wouldn't... He wouldn't try to leave me behind. Ah, me temo que lo voy a dejar aquí. Think about it. If Griff wasn't trying to ditch you, Mission, then why didn't he tell you where we were going? After we left Terrace, he told me looking after you was holding him back. Griff's always looking to blame other people for his own problems. That's why he abandoned you. He did the same thing to me too. As soon as I ran out of money. Hey, 
If you want to talk to Griff, go ahead. Last I heard, he was going to make a fortune working the Zerka Corp mines on Tatooine. Griff's better off without you anyway, you table dancing, brother stealing, home wrecker. I guess that's my cue to leave then. I didn't mean to upset you, Mission. Muy bien, pues lo voy a dejar aquí. Y en el siguiente vídeo, a ver si acabo ya con Dantuin. Muchas gracias y nos vemos.